Well, hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, we're in my shop again, and we're not doing any woodworking, we're kind of on a break right now before I start any other big projects. So I'm out here kind of having fun tinkering. And I thought it would be a good idea to see if this little tiny Sportsman 1000 surge watt inverter generator could power a 5000 BTU window air conditioner or a tiny little microwave. So this little generator so far has been pretty good. I'll have to admit it was, I got it for like 169 bucks on sale at Home Depot and it's been a pretty good generator so far, but I've never really pushed it. So I wanted to see if it'll run a 5000 BTU window unit uh, or this little tiny microwave. This microwave is, the output is 600 watts. The input rating is 950 watts. So that's going to be a really big test to see if this 950 watt microwave will be powered by this 1000 surge watt inverter. So again, this, this little sportsman's got a thousand surge watts, but a continuous running watts of 18, of 800. So I don't think it's going to run it, but it'll be fun to try. So anyway, guys, I'm going to take this out to the driveway, kind of set it up how I would use it. Um, here's the AC and another cool thing, you know, what's getting camping time here and in, in, in down in the South. So, you know, some of us might like a little bit of, of cold air in the tent. Um, and I'm hoping that this little generator will run this and I can come up with some type of contraption to, to install this uh, in, in the tent uh, when we do go camping. So, you know, just provide a little bit of relief. Um, but anyway, it's just a fun little experiment and I want to see if it'll work. So I'm going to set this up, get it started, and we'll go from there. Working fine. We can go to high fan. And it's pulling right around 70 volt amps. Okay, now's the test. Let's go to let's go to cool. I'm gonna start off with low cool. And you'll watch this compressor kick in. Oh, there we go. I heard it. Kind of hovering around 330 volt amps right now. Let's go to high cool. Right now this thing's only pulling 335 watts. It'll gradually increase, but so far this little tiny sportsman generator will definitely run a 5000 BTU. Um, this BTU is a Frigidaire mechanical control, nothing fancy about it. Uh, I'll put the link in the, in the description, but that's put down some cold air. And right now it's still only pulling 343 watts. So I think that answers my question that the fact that this Sportsman 1000 little inverter definitely will run this 5000 BTU window AC. So that's great to know. Uh, you know, use this in a, you know, your power goes out, stick it in your room. You've got AC, especially during the summer. Take this thing camping. You know, neither one of these things weigh a lot, so it's not going to increase your load a whole lot. Throw it in the back of your truck. Uh, but I'm pretty, that's pretty cool. I'm super happy that this little tiny generator will run this. Now, I've got other generators that will absolutely run this without a problem, but I was really hoping that this small one would do it. 
And it does, because this thing sips gas. I mean, it, it's half a tank runs for six and a half hours on about a on a 50% load. And right now, this isn't pulling 50% load. So, and that is cold air. So, there we go, guys. So, there's your answer. This definitely will run it. Now, let's push the microwave. Okay. Now, I'm almost certain that this little generator will not power this, but... It'll be an ex exercise for the generator. So I'm gonna put it just to, I'm gonna start it off on medium low setting and we'll see. It's working now. Nah. Let's try the medium setting. Oh, you can hear her trying. Got the overload light on. Yep, she died. I wasn't figuring that it would run this, but that's okay. I was really just wanting it to run the AC unit, so there you go, guys. Just a really quick, simple video proving that the Sportsman Generator 1000 can run a 5000 BTU. Now, I didn't have it on, on economy mode. Um, it probably would run it on, on economy after startup because it was only pulling around 350, 400 watts, but I would always start it without economy mode, but... Anyway, guys, if you were just wondering, uh, yeah, it'll run it. And these things go on sale all the time at Home Depot, so just keep checking back. In fact, their, Home Depot has them on their website right now for $250, and I definitely wouldn't spend that on it. Um, but they always have them on sale, so just keep checking. And, uh, you know, if you wanted to run a tiny little, little window unit, it'll do it. All right, guys, thanks.